Hey Dan's Army and welcome back to another YouTube video and in today's video we are going, I am going to be telling you guys my worst three highlights of the decade. Now some highlights are because of the product, some highlights are because of the packaging and some highlights are because of the amount. So yes, that is each highlight for one of them. Um, but... You know, I don't need this intro to be long. Let's roll the clip and we'll be going on. So, our first highlight is the Revolution, Mag Revolution London Strobe Highlighter in the shade Magnitude. Now, this is quite a nice highlighter when I first bought it. So, when I first got into makeup. But, it is just really chalky. Like, if you can hear that, it is just, no. Chalky is not what we like. So, bye, bitch. Um, but as well, what I don't like about this one also is the packaging. Um, there's nothing on it. Like, another highlight that I've got. So, this is from Revolution and this is from Revolution. Why not add something like Revolution and some glitter sparkles at the front or something? But, you know, some might have rubbed off. I think some was on the front, but it's rubbed off because I've had it for so long. Um, but because of its chalkiness, that is the one main reason that I don't like the highlight. Um, it does have some nice texture to it, but, you know, that's just, like I said, that's probably just like the chalkiness. Oh, I don't like saying that word, to be honest. Um, and it, it does come off quite you know, shiny and stuff, but um, it just looks too much. That's all I'm going to say, to be honest. It, it looks too much for what you're trying to do. And if you want to go with an, um, if you want to go with a basic look, this is not the highlight. No, this is not the highlight you want. So, um, sweetie, you've had your turn. Oh, goodbye. Um, we will go on to the next highlight. So, highlight number two. Um, it took me a while to get through this highlight because I loved it. I love to use it as blush as well. You guys could probably guess which one. Um, same again with the, um, it's the same as the Revolution one. It was a lovely colour. But it's Morphe. Morphe is quite a high-end brand and it was just chalky again like not as chalky but it it had that chalk to it if you know what i mean like um but other than that i have not used this highlight since i bought since it hit pan so um yes i don't think i want to say goodbye to this quite yet because i think i can either use it as blush or even more highlight like you know what i mean or an inner corner color um, but I just do want to put this aside and talk about it. Um, with this Morphe highlight, it is £12, yeah. Um, now I know with Morphe, you get what you pay for, basically. But I think with this highlight, I didn't get what I paid for because I used this highlight constantly for a week or two and I was starting to notice to hit pan. So then that's when I calmed it and going in two or three times a week with the highlight. And, like, there's not as much product in there as you would like. Like, let's open it back up. You can see the pan is supposed to be thick. But the pan is about that thick or thin, however you want to say it. Um, but normally with Morphe, you do get what you paid for. But considering it, it, let me just swatch it again. But considering 
it is just a lovely colour. I think I am going to keep it. Um, because, like, it has that rose, um, has that rose colour to it. Ro rose, rose, how rose, rose, however you want to say it. Um, but, you know, this will be cute for Valentine's Day tomorrow. Tomorrow. Sorry. Um, yeah, and that's all it, really. There's no tea, no shade with this. Um, the next purse, the next brand we are going to be talking about, there's been a lot of tea. And a lot of shade with him. Hi, how are you? So, so, like I did say, this is the third and final highlight. And you you guys will be like, Dan, why is the Jeff Star highlight in your not so liked? Of course, I'm fucking keeping it. Um, So, let's just, you know, do the info. So, this is from Jeff Star Cosmetics. It was 20, 25 pounds and it was on offer. Um... And it is from his Supreme Frost collection in the shade Hypothermia. Now, I do like the duo chrome and I do like the formula and like the texture of it is like it is to die for. But I have like bitch. Damn son, these bitches want none. Um but literally, I bought this. The start of January, and as you can see in the middle, we're starting to hit pan. Now, Jeffrey, you are saying that there's a lot of product, not a lot of product, sorry. Jeffrey, you might be saying how good the um highlight is, but which I completely agree with. But for the money, you know, good ain't enough. I need more product and more you know, stuff, um, I mean, more product, um, now he has came out with a, I think, I, I forgot what it's called, super, super, no, um, extra, sup I'll have a look, um, I'll look it up and I will put it in, um, but he has come out with a new one, which, oh, I want to get, but it's $50, so, need to calm on the money, um, but like, it's oh I can't even get my words out. This highlight is so amazing, but you you're not getting what you paid for, just like the Morphe one. You're not getting what you paid for because you are paying a lot more than the Morphe one. The Morphe one's twelve. This one full price is thirty thirty five. Um, so you don't know what. You're playing with basically. Um, I didn't know how much product was in this one. But, like this ain't me slating Jeffrey, so bitch, just calm down before I go. Oh my god, why are you putting a bad name on Jeffrey? Because I'm not, so calm it. Um, so this I love it. Like I absolutely love it. I love Jeffrey, but this is only in here because the amount that is on it. Like this ain't no fucking cheap ass formula. Amount that's in it. Um, but like, you know, I've got, I have got a lovely highlight on, um, which will be in another video, so stay tuned. Um, if we're just gonna, where are we gonna put this here? Okay, so you can't really see, but anyway, sorry, I was singing Whitney Houston. Um, so yeah, these were my three worst highlighters of the decade we have the morphe one in the shade daisy danger nice we have the revolution one in the shade magnitude and we have the jeffree star supreme frost one in the shade hypothermia um you guys please do put down below which one you liked which one you did not like and which one you'd throw in the trash um also let's start from a new question of the day Put down below, hashtag question of the day, followed up by a question, and I will pick someone in the next video to answer the question. Okay, guys, and just before we do end it here, 
the name was Extreme Frost. Yeah. Okay, guys, thank you so, so, so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy the video, please give it a huge thumbs up. If you did not, please give it a huge thumbs down. But either way, please tell me why. Also, please hit that big red subscribe button and that bell icon to get notified when I upload my next video. If you do want to follow me on my social media, I do have TikTok. Instagram and Snapchat. My Snapchat is Daniel Kelly 1202. My Instagram is Dan Does Makeup XOXO. And my TikTok is Lush underscore life. Also, like I did just say, if you do want to do a question of the day, remember just put it down below. I do love you guys so, so much. Have a nice night. Mwah.